I'll remove this transition by selecting it and deleting it. And we've already seen that if I select a clip, then I can call up the set default transition function here. And then this dissolve is inserted at its default length. And so we could ask ourselves, what if I wish to use a different transition? I must be able to specify this somewhere and where I'll show you now. I'll go back into my 2D transitions folder and I'll select a transition with the right mouse button. And now we can see the set as default effect function. And this option is obviously pretty simple to understand. I'll call this up for this transition and now the circle wipe is the default transition. If I now go to my clip and select it and then use the function set default transition, then we can see that the original transition isn't used, but the circle transition that we just specified to be the default transition. At the same time, a D is specified in the icon for this transition, which tells me this is the default transition. 